Rochester's Soldiers Field Aquatic Center is now open and welcoming swimmers, and we're anticipating temperatures rising into the 80s next week. It's a clear, sunny sign. Summer is nearly here, and with it, the risk of sunburns. KIMT Storm Team 3 meteorologist Travis Clark-Smith is looking at the importance of the UV index and sunscreen. The new Soldiers Field Aquatic Center is just one of many area locations where people can beat the heat and have some good old-fashioned summer fun. And with that fun, it's important to remain mindful of sun safety. One tool that can help make decisions in that regard is the ultraviolet, or UV, index, which provides a forecast of the risk of overexposure to UV radiation. The scale ranges from a minimum of 1, or little risk, to a maximum of 11 plus, or extreme risk. As the index rises, more protection from the sun is needed as the time that it takes for unprotected skin to burn decreases. Now I spoke with Sam Sonneband, aquatics director for the Rochester Swim Club, about how to best protect yourself when you're at the pool. He noted that the timing of sunscreen application is especially important. And applying sunscreen 30 minutes before you go swimming, contrary to popular belief, uh, before you go swimming, you should not be applying sunscreen. You should be applying before you even go to the pool. It needs 30 minutes to really soak in and provide maximum protection. It's also important to know that if you're going to be outdoors for an extended period of time, to reapply the sunscreen every so often and try to find some shade to limit your exposure. Dehydration and sun protection are number one in the summer to us, at least here at the pool. And if you're not sure how much UV radiation you're getting right now, an easy way to tell on the fly is the shadow test. If your shadow is shorter than you actually are, then your UV exposure is pretty high and you need to protect yourself right now. In Rochester, meteorologist Travis Clark Smith, KIMT News 3. It's also recommended you use at least an SPF 30 sunscreen to effectively keep yourself protected from the sun's rays.